I think a lot of what's occurring in the public service is, at the moment is about the shared service agenda. And I thought that it would be interesting to use forums like finance officers groups to say, should we do this a little bit differently? Why don't all their organisations pool their resources? Why don't they train together? And why don't the trainees then rotate across all of these organisations? And even better, why don't we go cross-sector? So this isn't just something that's included in local government. So it isn't just a county council, it isn't just a district council. Let's see if we can bring in the police authorities, the fire and rescue services. The chance you get to test out sort of soft skills, working in different teams, working across different teams, uh, working for different managers and possibly managing other staff throughout all those opportunities is, is just a really good a really good chance to sort of show your own skills and develop yourself. So um, depending upon the needs of the organisation, a student may spend six months working at a district on say closing the accounts, they may spend you know another six months working at the fire authority uh, supporting the preparation of their annual budget, they may spend some time at the county council and treasury management or internal audit. Um, so they will get a blend of experience that will enable them to fulfil their professional training requirements whilst also of course giving them an exposure to like I said different cultures, different setups, different working environments. Well the value is that I, I simply because my budgets won't, won't enable me to employ more accountants but having some bright people around who would, who would come and work within the fire service who wouldn't ordinarily but having that wider career option for them with the county council and other councils and the area and, and, and what have you, it's much more attractive for them, so I get better quality trainees. I love the fact that you're given so much opportunity from day one and that you're trusted to make good decisions about how you spend your time and when you study and when you work and how much effort you want to put in. Having the SIP for brand I think is really, really important. You know, I was really keen that we support SIP for students. Something that being a SITFA trainee helps you with is having the backing of SITFA and that someone has the confidence in you and therefore if you introduce yourself as a SITFA trainee people know that you come with that breadth of training, that breadth of experience and that's something that really carries you through. It's brilliant. It's brilliant because the thing that's brilliant about it is if you're an organisation like we are it's very easy for us to just see our world and not anybody else's. So to have a trainee who's coming from a district council, who's seen a different way of doing things, can bring something new. And to have a trainee who'll pick the phone up to their previous boss and say, I've got a problem with this, can you tell me how to do this? Or, we used to do something like this, I remember, can you send me that spreadsheet and all that kind of stuff. I think there's going to be a lot going on there. The other thing that's absolutely brilliant about this is that I can have trainees in when I need extra pairs of hands. So they can also help to deal with the peak natural peaks and troughs of the work. I'm very excited about that and I think it's something that we can move on and I think that other organisations will be able to engage in that. My challenge to my colleagues in other parts of the country would be, you know, they've got to think about the future. I think given the challenge that we all face across the country, this is a relatively simple way of alleviating some of those pressures. For the Nottinghamshire scheme, we were recruiting for eight positions. We had roughly 500 express interest and 271 went through the application process. So really excited the graduate market. Well, I, I think it's unique. I think there's no graduate scheme out there on the market at the moment for individuals interested in a career in finance that would uh, teach you the sixth professional qualification that would give you a 39 month contract. What's unique is that you will experience different organisations and rotate through organisations. It's just a great way to kickstart your career in the public sector and whether you work in local authorities or central government or the NHS or in things like, I mean the Olympic Delivery Board was a public sector institution. There's a vast amount of opportunity there and by doing SITFA you've already set yourself up to, to reach those heights and work across all those organisations. Part of my job is to ensure that I bring on the next generation and, and I would like to think that my fellow FDs across the country have got that same view. 
there's a kind of an ideological thing for me, and that I like the idea of having a trainee. The profession needs accountants in it. Um, and if we don't train them, and I want to say we, I mean the wider public sector, if we don't train them, they won't be there when we need them.